it just fell. Hi everybody! Welcome back to my channel. I have another unboxing video for you. Today I'm doing my ooh, Fab Fit Fun box and as a bonus, my Birch box, which also came today. So Fab Fit Fun, in case you don't know, is um, a $49.99 subscription box that you get once every season. So this is the winter box for 2018 and I'm super excited to get into this. So as always, it comes with a magazine with Brooke Burke on the front. I'm not exactly sure who Brooke Burke is, but I will have to read this to find out. So let's go ahead and get into this. So it looks like the first thing in the box is you will get a Mark and Graham color block throw in gray ivory or natural ivory. I got it in natural ivory. This is blanket. It's really soft. So as you can see, the color block, different colors. This is cozy. Yeah, this is happening the rest of you. This is really nice. I like being cozy. Okay, this retails for $49. So next, you get either the Bear Paw Combo Set Headband and Pop Top Glove Duo or a Mor Moroccan Gold Series Treatment Mask. So I got the glove and headband duo. This is the headband. Ooh, it's really nice and like, kind of, what is that, Sherpa? Is that what that's called? I don't know, it's really fuzzy on the inside. I look awesome right now. Yes. And then we have the gloves. I love these types of gloves. Looks really nice. This is amazing. I am so cozy. I'm living my best life right now. And then there we go. And then you just pop it off. And the glove and headband duo retails for $45. So next you would either get the Houston Jewelry Portfolio, the Orbe, I think it's Orbe, Gold Lust Dry Shampoo, or the Lili Sadoe, I'm sorry I'm mispronouncing that, Silver Circle Necklace. And I got the Orbe gold lust dry shampoo so this is what the unit carton looks like and this retails for 44 dollars what why is dry shampoo 44 dollars well so this is this is what it looks like i'm hit or miss with dry shampoo i really like the r and co desert valley one that's the only one that i found that really works for me personally but um i'll give this a try my hair is obviously not in the state to use dry shampoo at the moment but um I will be trying this out and maybe I'll do an update on some of these products and maybe my, on my Instagram or something. So follow me on Instagram at geeky glam with two M's on glam. So next you would either get the richer pour Reina over the knee textured sock, the Sherry Matthews acupuncture jade stone roller, or the pure be your selfie palette. And, and I got the socks, which we retail for $24. This is what the socks look like. Ooh, these look, oh my gosh, they're, they don't even fit on camera. There we go. They're so long. That's really awesome. And I think this is one of the things that I could customize. And I already have a jade roller and I have plenty of eyeshadow palettes. So that's why I went with the socks. And I just, I love them. they're not super soft, but like they feel really cozy. Ooh, they've got some gripper on the bottom. Oh, it's just the, the name of the company. So it's not actually a little grip. Next up, you either get the Bite Beauty Amuse Bouche Lipstick in Meringue, the Chic and Tonic All Coast to That four-piece coaster set, <laughs> All Coast to That, that's cute, or the Brooke Burke Body Sliders. And I got the Bite Beauty Lipstick in the shade Meringue. So let's... Oh, that's really nice. It's just like a, a, a pinky nude. Do a swatch. There's it swatched. I have used the Bite Beauty lipsticks before, and I, I really do love them. Yeah, and they smell delicious. They smell um, fruity, like citrusy. Um, and this retails for $26. Next up, you either get the Way of Will Elevate Essential Oil Set, Sweet Orange and Eucalyptus Oil, or the Anthropology X Mercy & Co. Sea Whip Body Cream and Coconut Sugar. And I got the essential oils. So this is what the box looks like. And it says, unlike typical essential oils, these oils can be applied directly onto the skin. Eucalyptus helps with sore muscles 
and cold symptoms and cold symptoms while sweet orange eases stomach cramps and headaches very interesting and this retails for $31 oh that is delightful that was sweet orange and yep that's eucalyptus it's nice so this is what the bottle looks like cute little bottle they say that they're cruelty free so they weren't tested on animals which is really good i just know that some essential oils aren't good for cats i just need to make sure that i i can put this on my body and if my cat licks it accidentally she won't be she won't be harmed because my cat likes to lick me she she's weird okay the next thing in the box is this thrive cosmetics brilliant eye brightener in stella and this is 24 dollars. so this is what the unit carton looks like okay so it looks like Kind of like a crayon sort of thing. Let's go ahead and swatch this. So that's what that looks like. Hold it up to the light. It's pretty subtle. Um, I already have on highlight, otherwise I would add this to my inner corner. It's pretty subtle, but um, could be nice on like a no makeup makeup day where you just put it in your inner corner and your brow bone and call it a day. Next up, we have the Ahava Hydration Cream Mask. And this retails for $33. It says, use it as a three-minute hydration boost or an overnight sleeping mask. I like sleeping masks. So this is what the bottle looks like. It's a nice, just like kind of clean scent. So it looks like this and then, hmm, nice and hydrating, which is great in the winter months. Obviously this is winter pox, everything in here is great for winter months. Um, my skin is usually pretty, pretty dry around this time as is, as is the case for most people. So, um, and then it looks like the last thing, yes, last thing in the box is the black hydrogel eye masks with hyaluronic acid. And these retail for $29. This is what they look like. <laughs> I love the back. It says late nights, too many cheeky wines. And let's not forget those carb on carb delights can have our peepers looking well, not so fresh. Leave the evidence of last night behind and pop on our activated charcoal eye mask to depuff, detox, and get back to your shiny, gorgeous self. Well, I would love to leave my carb on carb delights in the past and my cheeky wines. I mean, because I love both of those things. So this sounds great and I can't wait to try that. So let me do some quick math and I'll tell you the value of the box that I received. I'll be right back. And the value of the box that I received is $305. So... That's pretty great for only paying $49.95, something like that, for the box. I will leave a link in the description box where you can get FabFitFun. I know they also have starter boxes if you don't want the full box, but you want to try some of the, some of the things. Um, and yeah, I can't wait to try all of these things. Let's move into the Birchbox unboxing. This is what the box looks like. It's really pretty. So this is actually my first birch box i decided to subscribe because i know the birch box has more skincare stuff and i really like skincare and i saw this out on facebook and it got me and it's like use this code and you get a free thing that was like okay and the free thing was this milk makeup set and i'm like well i want to try milk makeup because i haven't really tried any of their stuff so i got sucked in so for those of you that don't know birch box is a ten dollar a month subscription box um and you get like sample size, like deluxe sample size. I don't know if they have any full size stuff or not. Like every once in a while, Ipsy throws in a full size product. I don't know if Birchbox does that or not. But in any case, um, let's go ahead and get into this unboxing. I'm gonna start with the little milk makeup thing. It comes in this little bag. So there's three things in here. The matte bronzer, which I've actually heard somebody say that was really good. Um, I'm, I've never really been into cream bronzers or anything, but you know, maybe I'll try. There's the matte bronzer. Um, it's a little on the orangey warm side for my taste, but you know, I'll probably give this a try. Um, I believe the shade name is Baked for that. So the next thing is a lip and cheek stick in the shade Perk. So there's that. It's a nice, nice shade actually. Um, it looks very bright on the stick, but when you get it on the skin, it doesn't look that bad. I will get better at, sw at swatching. I am not great. And then the last thing is a highlighting stick in the shade Lit. That's pretty. It's kind of subtle, 
but I think cream products are usually more on the subtle side. I could be wrong, but I usually use powder products because I feel like they pack more of a punch. All right, so I'm gonna wipe these swatches off before I get it all over my beautiful new blanket and I'll be right back. Okay, so next we're gonna get into the birch box itself. Okay, freshen up your winter vanity with these products. All right, let's see what I have first. I have some lovely foil packets of shampoo and conditioner. These claim that they are bonus products. These are the Devine's Old Shampoo and Conditioner for all hair types. The full size shampoo is $31 and the full size conditioner is $38. I mean, these, to be fair, I've had the foil packets before and to be, you know, these aren't horribly um, underfilled. The conditioner actually feels like I could probably condition all of my hair. I mean, my hair is pretty thick and long, so I feel like I might be able to get a use out of these. We'll see. The next thing I have is this 100% pure green tea EGCG concentrate cream. It says that this offers intensive healing. Intensive healing. That's a big claim. You can smell the green tea. It smells exactly like green tea. Um, it's nice. I wouldn't call it intense moisture. I've I've had moisturizers that feel more hydrating than this, but you know, it does feel really nice. So I will definitely be giving that a try. Next thing we have is this Chella eyebrow pencil and tantalizing taupe. The full size of this is $20. So I wonder if this is the full size or not. I don't know. Usually I can't use taupe pencils because they're way too light for me. So there's its swatch. And I had to do it a couple times to get it to be that dark. And I think that would be too light for me. Um, so I might pass this on to a friend who will get better use out of this than I will who has lighter hair than I do. The next thing in the box is this Marcel City Multi Protection Tinted Cream. So SBF 20. This is in the shade Fair. Okay, so there it is, let's see. Yeah, there's, you can't really see it. There's really no coverage, but it is just a tinted moisturizer, so it's not really meant to have any sort of coverage. So I wonder how this would do as like a base underneath makeup, so maybe I'll try it that way. Um, since it doesn't really provide any sort of coverage and like I can see a little bit of color, but like barely anything. So this might be good to put under makeup as as your as your SPF for that for that day. Next thing I have is this oh same brand as the shampoo and conditioner Devine's. This is the all in one milk, a multi benefit beauty treatment. This is a nourishing leave in treatment that detangles while adding volume shine and heat protection. That sounds amazing because my hair always gets super tangled. It's a spray bottle. Okay, well. It smells like hair product. Like it doesn't smell bad, but it smells like like hairspray. The last thing I have in the box is from Queen Studio. And this is a matte lip stain in the shade Expensive Taste. This is a really kind of bright pink. Not really the color I like to wear. Let's see. Oh, it's it's not as bright, okay. It doesn't look as bright when you swatch it. That's pretty. It's more red than pink. At least like in person, it looks more red and pink. I don't know how it's gonna turn out on camera. So yeah, that was everything in my FabFitFun box and my Birch box for the month of December. Um, I am really excited to try a lot of these products and I am like, I'm living my best life right now. I love my cozy blanket. Um, it's so nice. There was, in last year's winter box, we got this like shawl thing that I still use right here i keep it on the back of my chair i'll just layer up i still wear i use this a lot of time when i'm doing my makeup in the morning or i'm editing and i just want to be super cozy and i tend to keep my apartment pretty cold so like i like having things to like cuddle up with and um my cat doesn't always want to cuddle so don't always have that as an option so let me know what you think about the the winter box for fab the fun and the birch box um I'll give Birchbox a couple months. I'm not really overly thrilled with it. So I have to give it a couple months to see if I'm gonna kind of stick with it. 
or not. Give this video a thumbs up if you like the video, please, and subscribe to my channel. I'd love to have you. I'm still a new channel, so I'm still kind of growing, but I really have fun doing these unboxings. I mean, I love watching unboxing videos, so doing one is super fun. And I had a lot of fun with the BoxyCharm unboxings, the one for November, and then the one I just um, posted. And I'll probably be doing my Ipsy one soon. I should be getting those bags very soon. And then I'll post that one. And remember to stay nerdy and spread positivity because there's enough negativity in the world and we don't need that anymore. So I hope you all are having an amazing day wherever you are in the world or wherever you are in your life. Just remember, stay nerdy, stay positive, and I'll see you all in the next one. Bye! Mwah! Am I a sock yet?